A few months ago we told you how in Scotland opening churches was illegal, and that several pastors had strongly protested this. Well, church closings in Scotland have been declared unconstitutional in Scottish courts. Lord Braid ruled that the closure of churches by the Scottish government during the COVID-19 shutdown was unconstitutional and a disproportionate interference with Article 9 of the European Convention on Human Rights. The Right to Freedom of Thought, Conscience and Religion At trial, Lord Braid writes, It is impossible to measure the effect of these restrictions on those with religious beliefs. It goes beyond the mere loss of company and the inability to attend a lunch club. Similarly, while respondents have made funds available to encourage participation in online services by the elderly and vulnerable, among others, to aid digital connectivity, this is not a substitute for worship. Lord Braid added that, I have not decided that all churches should open immediately or that it is safe for them to do so, or even that no restrictions are warranted. He explained that there was an unfair distinction between different parts of society. Respondents had not recognized that the manifestation of religious beliefs was a fundamental right and freedom, and had been wrong to treat it as if it were a non-essential activity, when this was not the case. In considering proportionality, the court should take into account that other activities or businesses, such as professional sports and banking, have been allowed to continue to operate. The courts also continued to operate, including the use of jury centers in the courts. Cinemas. Churches could function with more public safety in mind than, for example, supermarkets, which had been allowed to stay open. Thank you for choosing us to inform you. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell with the option all, so that you receive notifications of new videos, and do not miss any news of Christianity. I say goodbye until the next video. Blessings.